how to fix Fortnite and error connecting Fortnite server error code ESP DIST001 your Xbox. First and foremost, what you have to do is hard reset your Xbox. Try performing a hard reset. For this, you need to hold down your power button for at least 10 seconds until the console is turned off, wait for a bit of time and then turn back the console on. Next step, you have to clear the cache. Clearing your cache in Xbox can help you with a lot of things. What you have to do is you have to go to the settings tab, choose system then go to storage and you will find clear local save games. Simply click on it, it will take a bit of time to clear the cache. Once it is done, try your game, see if that helps. Next step, update your system software. If you have not updated to the latest version, follow these steps. First, press the Xbox button to open your guide and select profile and system. Select settings. From there, you have to move to system. You have to choose update and downloads and you will find the option of update console. Simply download it if you have not updated to the latest version. Once it is finished, restart your console and then try the game, see if that helps. Next step, you can try changing your network. If you have any issues, being it a server issue or connecting to a game, simply change the network. What I mean is, if you have a LAN connection connected to your device, try changing it to your mobile data or mobile hotspot or any other network which is completely different from the network you're currently using. Once it is done, you log in into your game, see if that helps. Next step, try signing into a other platform like a PC for instance and see if you're getting the error over there. If the error is not coming over there on the other platform, don't worry about it, it will be a very minor issue in your Xbox. Probably a small patch from Fortnite or Xbox will fix the problem. Lastly, change your DNS server manually. For this, you have to press the Xbox button on your controller, select profile and system. Choose settings from here and go to general tab. Here you will find the network settings. Select advanced settings from your net screen options and select DNS settings. Select manual and enter the DNS settings. From there you have to choose whether to choose DNS server provided by ISP or public DNS server. Since we're going to put a manual public DNS server for the primary you need to input 1111 and the secondary would be 1001 which is the Cloudflare DNS server. You can also use the Google DNS server which is 8888 and 8844. But the Cloudflare DNS server is much more stable if you compare with the Google one but you can try see which one is more stable for you. So those were the steps in order to fix this problem. If you're still having the issue you can comment down in the comment section or you can connect me in my X handle. You can tag me over there put a screenshot if you're facing any errors. If this video helped you please don't forget to like button. Consider subscribing my channel if you're new here. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.